we can now view the complete scenario of the prison brawl in the action pack series adaption of Reacher. It's a sight to behold. In the bathroom, Richson and another prisoner use his remarkable physique to take down the welcoming committee. It doesn't take long for Richson's Reacher to drop all of the culprit's bodies to the floor, bloodied and bruised, while only incurring a few scratches on himself. So, here's everything we can expect for Alan Richson's upcoming TV series, Reacher. Jack Reacher returns to television. On February 4th, 2022, Prime Video will debut a new television series called Reacher. It's based on Killing Floor, the first Jack Reacher novel written by Child, which was initially released in 1997. Reacher is arrested for murder in the small town of Margrave, Georgia. In the book, Reacher is a retired military investigator who is enlisted by the townspeople to assist them in solving a series of murders. Alan Richson, the middle son of a retired Air Force Chief Master Sergeant, plays Reacher in the new series. When he knelt down on one knee to sing You Are the Sunshine of My Life to Paula Abdul on American Idol in 2004, he became famous. We'll assume this version has experienced action in either Iraq or Afghanistan because the new television Reacher has a bronze star, a silver star, and a purple heart, as the trailer shows. Now that Reacher is about the proper height, let's hope that most loyal followers can handle the update. The new series is directed by Nick Santoro, a writer and producer, with credits on The Sopranos, Law & Order, Prison Break, and Scorpion. He's got the experience and the skill set to handle this assignment. Reacher trailer brings a bigger, better, badass Jack to Amazon. The release of the new trailer for Amazon Prime Video's TV adaption of Lee Child's Jack Reacher novels, in addition to their fantasy offerings of Lord of the Rings and The Wheel of Time, has added to their Tough Man action collection. It will now be home to Reacher, a giant of an investigator who will be far closer in appearance than Tom Cruise was in 2012 big screen movie adaption with Titan star Alan Richson's in the lead. After bringing Tom Clancy's Jack Ryan to screens for three seasons and a fourth already on the way, the eight-part first season of the new Jack Reacher series will be based on Child's first Reacher novel, Killing Floor, which introduced the ex-military police detective shortly after his return to civilian life. Reacher travels the country without a phone, a home, or any other possessions. He will need all of his brains and physical features to defend his innocence when he arrives in a small village and is accused of the first murder to take place there in over two decades. Despite Tom Cruise's appearance in the 2012 film Jack Reacher and its 2016 sequel, fans who had read the books were quick to point out that while Cruise was the big name the company wanted to cast in the film, he was far from the 6'5", 240-pound man mountain depicted in the books. Literally. With regards to Amazon TV's adaption of Reacher, Lee Child argued that the time the character should be more in line with Reacher's physical description, and appears that someone paid notice. A brutal beating by an Amazon action hero. As Alan Richson's ludicrously burly lead character Jack Reacher delivers a violent beatdown on an assortment of dumb bad guys in a new clip from Amazon's upcoming adaption, Reacher, he kicks asses and isn't interested in taking any names. The Reacher film, which was released by Prime Video, suggests the kind of action that fans of the source material will enjoy, as Alan Richen uses his fearsome stature to his advantage, flinging it around with grace as he punches, kicks, and fractures bones. Moreover, Alan Richson uses Jack Reacher's trademark headbutt to wreak havoc on a group of inmates who have chosen to fight him for no reason. To be honest, it begs the question of why anyone standing anywhere near Jack Reacher would ever fight him. On the other hand, action aficionados will be delighted they did so. Jail Fight Scene We can view the complete combat scenario in the prison in the new video of the series. It's also fantastic. A welcoming committee that he and another prisoner are meeting in the closet is being thwarted by Richson's intimidating size, and everything appears to be on par with the film Raid. However, it is clear that we are in for a really good action film. 
The first prolonged look at the series' action choreography is in the battle sequence. The novel's main narrational device was Reacher's capacity to meticulously plan and then improvise during battle scenes, which was analogous to reading a video game character's thoughts after he was given a cheat code. The conflicts seem to be a touch unfair at times. It looks like we'll get something similar to the novel's rapid brutality, as well as its occasional humor, despite the fact that the scene felt a little too reliant on fast editing. Jack Reacher Prison Brawl Clip no apologies to Tom Cruise, whose original Jack Reacher films grossed over $400 million at the box office. But Richson's Reacher is what we've been waiting for. We get a terrific look at a huge man who is just whooping people in the prison brawl film, and he doesn't need any camera trickery or apple boxes to achieve it. We find Reacher surrounded by a bunch of prisoners who have one goal in mind, to take him out. He is somehow allowed to wear aviators while detained. Unfortunately for them, they plainly didn't know who they were up against, as Reacher slams them through the barriers like a sledgehammer. Reacher, regardless of how numerous he was, is no match for prison shivs, who lays them all out. Richson's action talents are well executed in the fight scene, which is masterfully coordinated. With a headbutt, the man kicks, punches, elbows, chops, and kicks all sorts of asses until the jail guards arrive and shuffle him out of the room. Fans of the books will be ecstatic if this is the type of action the show has in store. Jack Reacher's Updated Cast In September 2020, Deadline broke the first major casting news for Reacher. The new Reacher, Alan Richson, was named as the replacement for Tom Cruise. Let his on-screen credits spark your memory if the name doesn't instantly ring a bell. While Richson is a fairly talented man, it's fair to say he's been mostly sidelined in fairly archetypal roles where he gets to play the handsome, athletic guy who are here to save the day. He's known from popular fare like The Hunger Games Catching Fire, the 2014 live-action Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, or the DC TV series Titans. Obviously, it was a factor in his casting for Reacher, but Richson will also have the opportunity to show himself as the star in his own high-profile TV series. It also helps that Richson's description of Jack is more accurate than Childs, a 6'5 man with a military experience who also looks like it. In June 2021, new members of the Reacher cast were unveiled via deadline. Mark Ben David from Dark Matter plays Hubble, an accountant caught up in a unscrupulous business operations alongside Richson in Reacher. Charlie, a tougher-than-she-looks former debutante who is also Hubble's wife, is played by Kristen Crook of Smallville. Jasper, the medical examiner who is disturbed by the town's run of murders, will be played by Harvey Gillen of What We Do in the Shadows. Mosley, the village barber who becomes Reacher's ally, will be playing Willie C. Carpenter from Devious Maids. Kleiner Sr., played by Curry Graham from The Murder in the First, is a local businessman who saved the town of Margrave from extinction, but also has a darker side. Reacher's younger incarnation will be played by Maxwell Jenkins of Lost in Space. Reacher's Release Date Reacher, the series adaption of Lee Child's best-selling Jack Reacher novel starring Alan Richson, will launch on Friday, February 4th, 2022, according to Amazon's Prime Video. It also debuted the series' first trailer, which features Richson as a gigantic ex-military police investigator who aids those in needs. In more than 240 countries and territories, all eight episodes of the Amazon original series first season will be released on the same day. Amazon series has an opportunity to present Jack Reacher in a better light by showing his journey from beginning to end, as well as ensuring that if the show succeeds, more seasons will be produced. What are your thoughts on Alan Richson's Jack Reacher portrayal? Let us know what you think in the comments. I'll see you on the channel next time. Until then, it's goodbye.